pray. How are you today? Well, today is Thursday, the 25th of June, and we have revision on Unit 7 and 8, yes? And what's the weather like today? Is it a sunny day? No, 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 no. Is it a hot day? No, 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 no. It's windy, <sighs> cloudy, for in some moments sunny, but it's more cloudy and cold. Yes, okay. Well, for today, acordate que tienen que estar terminadas. Finished pages 87, 89, 90, and 91. Yes, okay. From activity book. Yes, is it clear? Good. So, um, let's go. I love, I really love the revisions, yes? Están muy lindas las revisiones, eh? Te va a encantar hacerla. Yes, okay, is it clear? So, let's go to unit 7. Van a ver dos um, materiales. Unit 7, unit 7 por un lado y unit 8 por el otro lado, ¿está? Yes, dos papers, dos trabajitos en el classroom. All right? Right, capaz que en el tuyo sale un poquitito cortado los question marks porque se habían. Yes, ok. Well, ask and answer. ¿Qué voy a preguntar acá? Peter, Tom, Anna, Jack and Lucy. What is Peter wearing? Voy a hacer el ejemplo primero, eh. Peter wearing. What is Tom wearing? What is Anna wearing? He is wearing, he is wearing. Y acá no te vayas a olvidar que cuando es singular, va la adelante. 
a blue t-shirt, puedes inventar el color, a blue t-shirt and red shoes. What is Anna wearing? What is Anna wearing? Y ojo cuando tengo acá la respuesta. He para él, she para ella y me fijo cómo escribo she. She is wearing a pink t-shirt and a blue skirt. Cuando es singular, la A adelante del color. Cuando es plural, no. A blue dress and black shoes. ¿Es clear? Toda la respuesta completa. Yes? Yes? All right. Question and answer. What's Peter wearing? What is Ruth and eh, Anna wearing? Y ahora nos vamos a listen and color. So we have a t-shirt, trousers, a coat, a skirt, trousers, boots, a t-shirt and skirt. Are you ready? ¿Tenés los colores preparados? Prepare your colors, please. Yes, yes, yes. All right. There we are. Track 19. 1. I'm wearing an orange t shirt and brown trousers. 2. I'm. Track 19. 1. La cela marquita. I'm wearing la... an orange t shirt and brown trousers. ¿Cómo te explica la teacher? Le haces la marquita siempre con el color y después te detenerás a pintarlo completamente. Le hago la marquita rápido. Orange, green, and then you paint it quietly. Track 19. One. I'm wearing an orange t-shirt and brown trousers. Two. I'm wearing a pink coat and a green skirt. Three. I'm wearing blue trousers and black boots. Four. I'm wearing a yellow skirt and a red t-shirt. Lo vas a rebobinar si quieres escucharlo once more, porque vos tenés el vídeo. Yes, is it clear? Vamos a listen, look, and put a tick or a cross, depending, depending on what you listen. Yes? Yes, teacher. Track 20. 1. What's the weather like? It's cloudy. 2. What's the weather like? It's rainy. 3. What's the weather like? It's snowy. 4. It's windy. Five. What's the weather like? It's sunny. Six. What's the weather like? It's hot. Okay. Yes, pay attention now. All right, vos lo podés repetir en casa. Yes, is it clear? Good. Let's go to unit 8. Once you finish unit 7, una vez que terminamos la 7, nos vamos a unit 8. Ok? Is it clear? Good. Read and circle. Then match. Acá hay que hacer tres cosas. Read, 
circle and match. Where is mom? He or she voy a elegir. She isn't in my house. He or she. She is in the garden. Yes? Ok. Y ahí voy a, a unir. Mami. Voy a poner, ustedes ven mejor ahí en el dibujito, con el garden. Yes? Voy a unir con el garden. Acá, en el garden. Two. Where is my brother? Que voy a elegir he or she. He isn't in the hall. He is in the garage. Y voy a buscar el, el brother. Aquí, en el garage. O garage. Está. Match. Read. Match. Yes. And circle. Read. Circle and match. Ok. Good. Listen. Listen and read. Then look and circle. Where's my sister? A or B? Where's my dad? Where's Dan? A or B? Where's Meg? In the living room or in the kitchen? Where is Grandad? In the living room or in the... <laughs> okay. In the kitchen or in the living room? Where's my cousin? In the bathroom? Or in the living room? Where's Sue? In the bathroom or in the attic? Creo que es en el attic. Yes, ustedes lo ven mejor en el dibujito. Where's Bill? In the bathroom? Yes, or in the attic? And where is my aunt? In the bathroom or in the bathroom? Yes, dije bien. Ok, are you ready? Yes, ok. Be prepared. Track 21. 1. Where's my sister? She isn't in the hall. She isn't in the living room. She's in the bedroom. Circle the bedroom. 2. Where's Dan? Is he in the kitchen with Granny? No. He's in the garage with Dad. Three. Is Meg in the attic? No. Sue is in the attic. Meg is in the kitchen. Four. Where's Grandad? Is he in the bathroom? No, he isn't in the bathroom. Grandad is in the garden. Five. Where's my cousin? I don't know. Is he in the living room? No, he isn't. Look, my cousin is in the hall. In the hall. Six. What's your favourite room, Sue? Do you like the attic? No, I don't. I don't like big spiders. My favourite room is my bedroom. I'm in the bedroom now. Seven. Is Bill feeding the guinea pig in the garden? No, he isn't. Bill is in the attic. He is tidying up. Eight. Where's my aunt? Is she in the kitchen? No, she isn't. Look, my aunt is in the bedroom. In the bedroom. Yes. Okay. Acorda.
parte que vos lo podés escuchar de vuelta a estos listening. Ask an answer. Ask an answer. Muy bien. Tilly, María, Martin, Lucy, John, Anne and Jack. Voy a hacer... Um, John, Jimmy, Jack, Anne... John, acá, justo que me sale en esta parte. John. John, tenemos el, el nombre aquí, John. Y voy a buscarlo a John. Primero voy a hacer todas las questions. Where is... Where is John? Copio bien el, el nombre. Where is John? He is in the living room. Yes, pero primero hago toda la misma técnica que hacemos acá. Escribo todas las preguntas. Where is fulanito? Where is pa pa pa? Where is ta ta tan? Los nombres que tengo aquí. Yes. Y después voy a las respuestas. Si es una girl, voy a decir she is in the kitchen. Where is Jack? He is in the kitchen. Where is John? He is in the living room. Where is Martin? He is in the bathroom. Y así. Primero todas las questions y cuando tengo todas las questions finished, las five questions, voy a las five answers. Porque mi cerebro se va a concentrar en las questions y después se va a concentrar en las answers. ¿Ok? ¿Es clear? Good. Yes, teacher. All right. Y hasta ahí llegamos, ¿ok? So, this is a revision on unit 5 and 6, ¿ok? Bueno, well, si no tenés todo completo el activity book, completalo porque la semana que viene me toca llevarlo, ¿está? Bye, bye, happy weekend, see you next class, bye, bye.